Hi everybody, Carl here. Today I'm gonna try something different and do an unboxing video of, as it says in the title, the Samsung Galaxy S2. It's the latest smartphone with Android from Samsung. It's said to be one of the best phones out there. Let's just hope it's up to the task. It came from Tele2 Sweden. This is the box they shipped it in. I opened it doesn't show you any personal information so you can track me down. But inside is Samsung Galaxy S2 1.2 gigahertz. And sleek box, it almost feels like there's some sort of fabric on it. But let's get to that later and see what else L2 shipped it with. Packing material. And uh, let's see here my new smart account with Frank on the front side seems to be a good deal that's not why we're here and this is a refill card for your old phone but I won't need that and here's the box we all been waiting for just black some it's noble black as it says samsung.com and some information don't know how clearly you can see that on the screen but it says dual core 1.2 gigahertz 8 megapixel out of focusing camera full HD 1080p video multi codec so you can play DivX or XVID video Bluetooth, GPS, DLNA, and a 1650 mAh battery. Super AMOLED, Android, Wi-Fi, DivX, 16GB version. So let's break the seal. It looks good. Not broken. And let's see what we can find. That is one sleek looking phone. Let's get that out of the way. Lift it up. Pretty large thing. It's very thin. So I'm saying we'll get to that in a minute. Put it right there. Plastic cover. Quick start guide, as you always get. Get different size earbuds for the headset. We get a headset. It's not special now, it's just made in China. Maybe I can rip it up from here. It's a, looks very nice, it's an in-air headset. There you have the answering thingy. Put that over there. Looks like crap. A USB to micro USB cable. So you can plug it in for charging. And then we have, oh, I thought this came with a USB charger where you can just plug in this cable like on the iPhone or other like HTC phones but this is a regular AC adapter to micro USB then we have the Samsung battery that should be it yeah let's get that out of the way and just organize this looks like crap. Take that out of the way. Let's bring all of this out of the way. As you can see, it's a pretty large phone, as I said. I have some comparison phones. This is the Nokia N95, 8GB. We have a spare phone, a Sony Ericsson G502, and a Sony Ericsson. Said 710i. 
as you can see, all of these phones can almost fit inside the screen. And well, uh, you can see that it's pretty huge. It's 4.3, 4.3 inch display. It's a Super AMOLED, as it says. It has a resolution of 480 times 800. Look at how thin that is for being such a power package. Let's rip this off. Hope that. Let's hope that noise, as most people like, from ripping off new plastic covers. Let's see if you can hear that. Maybe it's not that one you like. It's more this one. That's awesome. Let's attach that to my desk. Slick looking phone. You have the front facing camera. I believe it's two megapixels for making video calls. You have the home button. There are two touch buttons right here. You have the micro USB port. You have the speaker. The 8 megapixel camera. They can also film in 1080p. Uh, 30 frames per second, I think, and you have a strong LED flashlight. You have the volume rocker, I believe. Yeah, it's the volume rocker. A... I have no idea what that is. You have the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. This might be the microphone, maybe. And you have the lock and power button. Let's plug in the battery and see how fast it boots up. Take it from the side. Without breaking it. That would be a shame. That sounds horrible. Delete this off. So you have a micro SD slot and a SIM slot. And your battery. So let's plug this battery inside. Pretty massive battery as well. I'm not gonna plug in my SIM card just yet. I'll bring a new video when the phone is up and running with the 3G network. Yeah, I should probably tell you this, but this is not the US 4G version. This is the 3G version, so any any future videos I make, if I take make any data transfers outside, it will be 3G speeds. Why won't it plug back in? It's a bit of pain in the ass. I wish I had my GSM HTC Hero here, but unfortunately it's in the workshop being repaired for second time. Has the same screen problem. Now let's boot it up and see how fast first time booting is. Center this in the frame. That's a truly beautiful screen. Welcome, thank you. Touch the Android to begin. Pretty dark. Let's see if we can get us a bit closer. Kinda skip this. Gonna redo all this later. There we have it. Samsung Galaxy S2. Pretty sleek looking phone. Let's see if we can show you some speed tests. Pinch to zoom. Applications. Go smoothly between the home screen and applications. Let's see if we can 
we have all the regular things as you would expect we have the clock calendar email gmail maps camera internet this is probably what's new it's the social hub where samsung gathers all the like your twitter account facebook account myspace i think whoever uses that you have the music hub where you can download music much like itunes i believe readers hub where you have the, the ebooks and game hub can't access those now since i am not not hooked up to any internet you have keys air i believe that's the samsung version of transferring your files from your computer over the wi-fi to the phone navigation which i hope now works in sweden uh, so press conference where they said that it would be here in the nordic countries yeah it's not gonna work anyway voice command places downloads video maker voice search all share i have no idea what that is mini diary samsung app im memo you can probably see what the what the keyboard looks like hello i am your new phone Gomez mark and i believe this has swipe as well here you can see the touch buttons everything is goes so smoothly home button yeah so this was my first unboxing and the first look at the samsung galaxy s2 i hope you can join me in the future when i'll give you my thoughts on the phone and probably show you some fun games or so and uh, as always if you like this video please Press, press the thumbs up button, you don't have to, but it sure makes me happy. And uh, for more future, future videos on computer stuff, gaming, unboxing, be sure to subscribe. See you around, bye.